Hi guys, it's Barnaby for Spurred on Outside White Art Lane. We have just beaten the absolute might of Carabag 3-1. I've got old favourite Chris with me. Chris, give us a composed your composed feelings about that game, mate. Well, I thought it could have been about 10-5. Yeah. Um, I thought Sun was exceptional tonight. He just run and run and run and just didn't stop running. Um, I think he's going to be a great player for us um, this season and in the future. Um, and you know, you look at last season. You know, when you had Soldado, who weren't really doing much compared to Sun tonight, um, I think he's going to be great. And dare we even say uh, the old days of Emmanuel Adebayor seem a long way away now. Um, in terms of, there, there was a bit, I haven't really brought this up yet, but there was a, a, a danger moment in the second half where Eric Dyer went down clutching his hamstring. Considering we, he's pretty much our only defensive midfielder and he's really playing into the role, uh, you know, how frightening is that a prospect if he's, if he's got a little injury there? Yeah, but um, I, I think some Spurs fans would probably like to see more attacking uh, play instead of uh, a defensive midfielder. Um, I think a lot of fans like to see, um, like Deli Ali, people like that getting forward. Um, you know, people like him tonight were were fantastic. Um, you know, they just they just run for the team and 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 they're such hard working players, yeah. which uh, he, he fully deserves to be in our team at the moment. Yeah, I couldn't agree more. And actually, that, that's reminded me, it's a far cry, isn't it, from last year or the year before where we had those kind of mercenaries, your Paulinho's and Adebayor's who are just grabbing the money. At least all these players, even if they make a mistake, maybe Lamella apart, at least when they make a mistake, you're like, you know they're going to fight back, they're hungry for it and they want to play for the club. But the last few times I spoke um, to you um, about Lamella, I've been quite negative about him. But, you know, tonight he gave the ball away a few times, but it was a, it was a good finish. It was a good finish. You can't take that away from no, him. It was a lovely finish. And what I will say to his benefit, is he doesn't hide, he, he keeps yeah. trying to get the ball, but unfortunately when he keeps getting the ball, he does give it away whilst trying to do something more clever than he's capable of doing but with this level of confidence. I think uh, we've got a squad at the moment where there's so many players coming through. Um, you know, people are making mistakes. I don't think uh, Poch is going to, you know, keep them for too long. You know, they're, they're going to be moved on. And we can see that by the amount of players that we had here in the last season or two. You know, he's moved them on. We've got players in. And, you know, everyone is now fighting for positions. And I, I think it's, it's a real good thing that we have at the club at the moment. Yeah, it's, it's, a, it's a young squad with hunger and talent. I agree with you, Chris. Guys, let us know if you agree with us in the comments section below. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and follow us on Twitter at TV. Chris, thanks a lot, mate. Cheers.